And it's time now for a look at your full storm team forecast. All right, a pretty chilly start to our Saturday as temperatures have fallen back into the 30s. Live look over AmFam. We were uh, dealing with some basketball there uh, just the other day. They had the roof closed. Uh, northwest winds right now at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. And I got to tell you, uh, these last really 24, 48 hours have uh, been pretty extraordinary in the world of weather. Um, no stranger to big drops in temperatures across Wisconsin, especially in the month of November. I went back in the history books here uh, the other day and looked at some of the largest 24 hour drops in terms of temperatures. 42 degrees that uh, we plummeted back in the year 1985. It was between uh, the 19th and 20th of November. If you were curious, the other day we fell 36 degrees. We went from a high of 77 on our Thursday down into the upper 30s by Friday around 24 hours later. So a pretty impressive drop in temperatures. Of course, this morning our numbers quite chilly as well in the 30s. We're at 34 right now in Milwaukee. This is actually tied for the lowest temperature we've had so far this season. We met that number back in October. We have yet to hit 32. I'm going to be watching that number very closely here this morning. Otherwise, everybody else really around or just below that free uh, freezing mark. We still do have a northwest wind with us this morning, about 5 to 10 miles per hour, so it is making it feel awfully chilly out there with wind chills in the 20s. So definitely want to have that heavy jacket if you'll be out for an early morning jog or uh, walk with the dog numbers this afternoon only climbing into the mid and upper 30s area wide and then as we head into our Sunday we're going to have cloud cover today those isolated really snow showers I was telling you about those will be around today then the clouds clear out overnight and then that's going to allow uh, temperatures to be pretty chilly as we head into our Sunday forecast. All right, let's take a look at uh, what we're looking at next. It's accumulating snowfall next Tuesday into Wednesday. What we know right now is that it's not going to be a whole lot of snow. It's probably enough to still cause an impact, but not necessarily a major snowfall for us. What we still don't know at this point are the exact timing and amounts. So you want to stay up to date with the forecast. Here's what we're looking at for today. Again, backside of the system, opportunity for a couple of snow showers. We head into our Sunday, things are looking pretty good. So not really looking at a whole lot of snow today. It's really just an opportunity to drop that visibility for a bit and also pick up maybe a dusting on some grassy surfaces and maybe even an opportunity on some of those elevated surfaces as well. As we head into our Tuesday, Wednesday, it does look like we'll start to see some of that snow fall around the area and not really looking at a whole lot of snow again. Temperatures in the upper 30s for our Saturday and our Sunday, 40 for our Monday. Day, still staying chilly into next week. That chance of snow.